Welcome to the Entrepreneur's MBA, bringing you lessons from real life entrepreneurs they don't teach in business school. Here's your host, business coach and marketing strategist, Adam Kipnis. We are back on the Entrepreneur's MBA podcast. Uh, I am your host, Adam Kipnis. Uh, today is part two of my interview um, on KTAR here in Phoenix. Uh, hosted by Mike Weinstein, his old show, It's Business Time. Um, there's some great archives of things that he's done um, on the internet that you can listen to. Um, and we talk more about um, the power of coaching and, and the need for coaching. During this segment, um, Mike makes a, a, an offer for a free coaching session with me by texting a number. Um, that was specific to the show. Um, that text number, but I will still offer that free coaching session to anyone who wants it. You know, we, we just get on the phone and ideally you walk away with nuggets that you can immediately implement in your business to make more money and drive more clients. Um, just go to www.new10k.com. That's N-E-W-1-0-K.com. And we'll set up a time to talk. What I do in that one hour consultation is show you ideas and strategies to drive new business. Um, so hopefully that's something that you take me up on. Um, also don't forget to hopefully go out and get my book at freebookfromadam.com. Um, the lead in to this one is, uh, Mike talking to someone who's not there. So, um, Hopefully that'll at least put a small smile on your face because he's a little goofy. Um, and then we get into the second part of the interview. Uh, but thanks for listening. Hope you enjoy it. And please go out and um, give me feedback. Um, comments and, and ratings obviously help the podcast get to a greater audience. Um, and I'd love for you as part of my community to um, go out and rate and review the show and give me ideas of what you'd like to hear more. Talk to you all soon. Jobs, growing our economy, growing Arizona. It's business time with Mike Weinstein. Hey, where are you going, Tyler? Man, what a great job. I always like to be here on the weekends and, and watch these guys come on here and, and do the first newscast. Good job. He's ignoring me. He's walking out. It doesn't really matter. I don't think he realized that we're talking about him, but we're saving him a hi and good job, Tyler. So. Well, I'll tell you what. If, so, he, if he's going to stick around this place, he better know that people are talking about him because that's what we do. We talk I about know. Him. We just talk in this business. Go <laughs> figure, right? All right. We are continuing our conversation and in studio with Adam Kipnis from the 1495 Group specializing in helping small business. We talked about this last segment on how so many of us as as children, we played sports, we played sports at the collegiate level, high school level, maybe in the professional level. No matter the sport, we always had coaches because coaches help us get to that next level. But oftentimes in the business world, we don't necessarily compute the two that, hey, a coach can help us. And that's what Adam specializes in, helping small businesses. He's been doing it and helping owners for over eight, or for over 16 years. Uh, he works with over 200 businesses uh, on an ongoing basis. And he's offering a free offer to our listeners. All you have to do is text the word COACH to 411-923. He is going to give you a free one-hour coaching session. Okay, no obligation, no strings attached. I would strongly encourage each of you, no matter where you are at in business, take advantage of an offer like this. I have had business coaches. I have business coaches. I am never without a business coach of some sort, some sort of confidant, because they, they serve so many purposes, whether it's my sounding board, whether to tell me one of my crazy ideas is crazy, or just to help me fine-tune those ideas. So, Adam, welcome back. Um, Thank you. Why do we need a, a coach? What is it? That, what's the big benefit that you bring to the table to us as business owners, entrepreneurs, and the like? The biggest benefit of a coach is going to be one of two things. It's either going to be a sounding board, someone to listen to your ideas, to help vet through your ideas and work through them, or it's going to be an idea person, somebody that can help you shape that idea so they can either listen and help or give ideas that you can mold into your business. Those are the two biggest things that I work on with my clients. Now you have a you have another thing. You have, you have a, a free guide that you want to make that you want to offer to our listeners. Tell us what's in the guide. How that helps us. Why every one of us who is an entrepreneur has a business should should have it. So I, I have a free guide that's based on 
the six ways to make your business more abundant, to grow your business, to turbocharge your business. And in those, in the guide, it walks you through six steps. And for most people, two or three may be critical today and the others may be critical in the future, but it gives you six steps on what you can do in your business today, things to look for and how to be more successful. All right, so uh, give us a little sneak peek. Give us an example of a, of a couple of these things that we're going to take away from this free guide. So the first thing is clarifying your vision. Every business needs to know what the vision is. Otherwise, you're just working day to day. So really clarifying what do you want from your business? What do you want from your future? What do you want from your life? Because small business owners, business is life. And if you really clarify that, it gives you a whole direction and, and makes a roadmap for you. So what, what I find a challenge for, for business owners is, and, and sometimes we just we need to be reminded and we need to have a clear definition of what the word vision means because it doesn't necessarily the vision isn't necessarily the set of of small goals and and so forth uh, as much as what so how do you define what vision is how do you separate the vision from the concept of putting down goals and achieving those goals and where the goals lead you so goals are great goals typically are short term vision is big it's long term i mean it's hunking big you want that to be 10 years 15 years from now what do i want from this business and then we can work backwards so goals are what do i want to achieve in 2016 what do i want to achieve this month vision is where do i see my life in this business 5, 10, 15 years down the road. All right, so if you want a copy of Adam's free guide, here's what I'm going to have you do. I'm going to have you text the word guide, include your email address. All you got to do is text the word guide, include your email address, and we're going to email you this free guide, and then it's free. It's, it's, and, I'm, I, you know, and I'm always every day reading stuff, being reminded of stuff, and so it's a phenomenal resource for you just for our KTR listeners. So again, text the word guide, include your email, and text it to 411-923. Adam will get you a copy of this free guide for free. What else is in the guide? Uh, the, the next step in the guide is uh, utilizing or upgrading your skills. We all have skills and many times we don't use the things that we're good at in our business. We're too busy doing the day-to-day. -day. So utilize the skills, or if you don't have a skill, upgrade that skill, and sometimes upgrading means hiring it. All right, give me one more. One more is going to be tailor your expectations. We talked a little bit about goals, and we all set goals for ourselves, and goals, unfortunately, many times turn into dreams. Expectations, we expect our children to do well in school. We expect our employees to show up for work, but we set goals for ourselves. I work with my clients to set expectations for themselves. What do they expect to do this year? Expectations become results. I have learned as, as I've gotten older, and another year older today, I might say, uh, it's, I'm finding that, and I used to say this, trying to just really just try to be funny, but the more I think about it, the more and more truth I find it. The secret to life is the ability to manage expectations. You have to be able to manage expectations. That's why everybody that listens to this show knows if you keep your expectations low, you won't be disappointed in the show. But it's with other people in my life is when they understand what truly what they should expect from me, okay, and what I can truly deliver, it eliminates frustration and vice versa. If you know someone's not going to be able to achieve a, a certain level, but you know what they can achieve, and if you can manage those expectations and understand those expectations, life's a lot more simpler. Oh, I would agree. I would agree. Expectations are, it's, it's partially a scary word because whenever people put expectations on us, we want to live up to them. Um, and I think that's a positive thing. I think that's useful in business that if we scare ourselves a little, we will achieve more and we'll do better. And with me by your side, I will help make sure that that happens. Go ahead and text the word guide with your email address, and Adam's going to get you a copy of the free guide. As always, no strings attached, no anything. A phenomenal read. Also, if you want to take advantage, and this is an offer just for our KTR listeners, for those of you that listen to It's Business Time, uh, he is offering each one of our listeners who has a business, and, and I want to go into something else in just a second, but a free one-hour coaching session uh, just just free. All you got to do is text 
text the word COACH to 411923. We're going to send you to a website that you have to sign up for, and Adam's going to get in contact with you uh, and, and set up this free coaching service. What I love about what you're willing to do um, and your passion is what about the guy that's on the couch right now been toying around with this idea? He's got a business concept. He's got a business idea but just really hasn't had the, the courage to get off the couch, do something about it, but has nobody that they can go to as that sounding board and help them just, is this a good idea or not? Where do I start? I, and the beautiful thing is you can actually call me from your couch, so you don't even have to get up, <laughs> um, which makes it really, really easy. No, I think it's many of my clients uh, are starting a business or taking their business in a new direction, adding something new to it. And that's the scariest part about business. It's also the most exciting part. So if that's where you are, pick up the phone, let's talk for an hour and vet the idea. Let's, t let's break it down, figure out who are the clients gonna be? What do you want from the business? What are the advantages that you can bring to this business? And um, what's the value it's gonna bring to your clientele? If we look through those four things, vision, value, avatar advantages and we can figure out what those are you've got a business idea and now it's time to get off and running now adam works with over 200 businesses on an ongoing basis um i know just from the events and the things that i go to everybody's a business coach everybody wants to be a public speaker everybody wants to be a motivational speaker and everybody wants to be a business coach uh, but adam is somebody who's actually doing it adam is somebody that i talk with on a regular basis again works with over 200 businesses on an ongoing basis if you want to take advantage of his free guide text the word guide with your email address to 411 923 in addition, if you want to sign up for a free one-hour coaching session, please text the word COACH to 411-923. Again, text the word COACH to 411-923. This is Adam from, uh, from the 1495 group. Love the story. Adam, what's the last thing that you want to say to entrepreneurs? You, you've got 30 seconds, the capstone class at the W.P. Scary Carey School of Business. What is it that you would say to us as business owners? The most important part about being a business owner is delivering the value to the people that you want that value delivered to. And I believe in my life and in my success and in my client's success that having somebody to help you along the way is going to make you three times more successful than trying to do it alone. So whether it's me or somebody else, read a book, get a coach, get a partner to help you think through what where your business is going and how you can help more and more people and that's what i'm here to do is try and help you so you can help your clients and customers all right if you want to take advantage of the free hour one coaching session with adam go and text the word coach to 411-923 we're going to get you a link to where you can sign up for this adam we appreciate you joining us when we come back i tell you what there are so many different places though so many different resources that we can go to when it, talking about marketing you don't even know what to do but what if we could just simplify marketing? Well, we're going to talk to an expert next on It's Business Time. She gets to the lady's house. This is in London. There's 15 pounds in cash sitting on the table. And Kamalita looks at it and says, it's a little weird, but okay. <laughs> they go on with the meeting, explaining who's going to be there, some of the speakers, a little story about Sharon and, and what she's done. And the lady at the end of it says, I am in. This is fantastic. I want to come. Kamalita says, great. Love to have you. I will email you over the, all the information when I get back to the office and gets up to leave. And the lady says at the end, um, don't forget your money. And Kamalita says, what money? And the lady said, you said $14.95, right? $14. Right? There's $15 right there. $14.95 says, great reminder, as business owners, we have got to articulate. We have got to communicate the expectations from our clients. When we come back, we're going to dig into Adam's brain and get four secrets from him on It's Business Time. You've been listening to The Entrepreneur's MBA. Download Adam's free book, How to Make More Money in Your Business, at www.freebookfromadam.com.